Hey guys, I am Miss Jenkins. I am the principal here at the Intermediate School. I am so excited to start 1819. Let us know if you need anything in the office. And this is my partner in crime. Hello everyone, welcome back. Hopefully you had a fantastic summer. We've been waiting for you. We have been up here all night just wondering when you were coming back. But I am the assistant principal. Uh, we're going to have a great time this year. We have a lot of helping hands activities and just a lot of other things we'll be talking to you about. So welcome back. Hey, China Spring Intermediate. I'm Jennifer May, one of the counselors. And I am Mrs. Trevino. I'm the other counselor. And we are here. We're located here in the office. And if you ever have any concerns, any problems, anything you want to talk about, you can come down and see one of us. We'll be happy to help and we're glad you're back at school. Have a great year. Hey, China Spring Cougars, I'm Miss Husky and I work in the office. So when you walk on by, give us a wave. Hi, China Spring Intermediate, I am Nurse Springer. I'm taking Nurse Debbie's place if you were here last year. If you're not feeling well or you have a boo-boo, come down and see me, I'm by the office. Hey, China Spring Intermediate, I'm Miss Maddox and this is Miss Tice. Uh, we work in the office. We hope everybody has a great year and we'll see you around. to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one indivisible. Today I will do more than I have to do. I will treat others as I want to be treated and I will try to become a better person. I commit, I commit to walking in a line, to walking in a line, quiet under big blue, quiet under big blue. Hey, China Spring Intermediate. I'm Mrs. Husky, as you heard earlier in the video, but we have a challenge for some of you, and with cell phones being completely unavailable during school time so they have to be often in your locker we do have a phone in the office and I know this is like an ancient phone to most of you but this is in the office and if you need it there's certain reasons to call your parents emergencies obviously if you need to know how you're getting home if you forgot maybe your medication something like that um, and it's important to call not just can I go to a friend's house or you know um, whatever um other than something of importance please do not come down and use the phone that's something you can discuss with your parents when you get out of school but if you need to use the phone it is located in the office um right at the front desk by miss tice and you will walk in and you'll ask politely to use the phone please do not just walk in and pick up the phone and start dialing um and we do have a challenge for the first month of school. So if you come in the office and you need to call your parents for an important reason, and you, one, know how to use the phone, and two, you know your parents' phone number where we don't have to look it up, you will get rewarded for that. So I'm gonna show you how to use the phone. You're going to pick up the phone and put it to your ear. You will dial eight to call out, and if you have a 254 number, you will just dial the phone number and put the, leave the phone to your ear. If you do not have a 254 number, you'll dial 8-1, the area code, then the phone number. After you complete your phone call, you'll just hang up the phone. That's all you have to do. So if you need the phone, it is located in the office. Please make sure you know your parents' phone number for emergency reasons. It's very important. And make sure you know how to use the phone. Monday's lunch is barbecue dippers with rolls. Hey guys, well I'm bringing you your trivia question for the week. So some of you new fourth graders and some of you new students here at Chime Spring Intermediate, we do trivia questions, a weekly trivia question every week. And we have a trivia box that is located in the office. 
So what you'll do is write your first and last name on a piece of paper, write your answer, and go stick it in the trivia box. And we draw those every Thursday afternoon. So if you wanna be a part of trivia and possibly win a prize, you need to make sure you get your answers in by Thursday. Okay, so listen up. Your first trivia question is, why are school buses yellow? Good luck. <laughs> 